Piat UGM held a summer course. The summer course theme is on smart integrated farming for sustainable agriculture. The summer course bring around 12 experts from over the world, from Australia, from Malaysia, from UK, and from uh, Indonesia come here to give a lecture to young students, very bright future leaders in agriculture. This is a very interesting summer school. The participants, the speakers and the students have a wide range of interests in agriculture. But my interest specifically is in soil management. And soils are managed for agriculture so that we make a big production. But often the biological components of soil are not taken into account in this production system. So for sustainable agriculture, it's very good to make the most of the biological processes that occur in soil. And that's what I study. And hopefully my contribution here at the workshop has made some impact on understanding of soil biology and how important it is to sustainable agriculture. I'm 
extremely honoured to have been asked to speak at the summer school here at the university. Um, I am having a wonderful time and I have met so many interesting students from very many countries in the world who are really engaged in the ideas surrounding sustainable agriculture. I'm also uh, extremely delighted to meet Professor Chandra who has organised this wonderful summer school. I would say that I would recommend this to people to come here in the future. very excited when I was asked to participate in this course because it's about the sustainability of farming, about the future of farming, about the production of food for the world. And it's really important that we engage with young people in many countries around the world to address this problem because after all, we understand that there are challenges here in the production of food in a sustainable way. We understand that there are major threats to the planetary system caused by us producing food for an ever-increasing human population. So we have to be clever about this. And my important message here was that although we know we need to feed 3.5 billion more people, we don't have to produce more food to do that. We can, we can actually feed these people just by simply being more intelligent about how we handle, plan, process the food that we produce already. This summer school is an excellent idea. It brings together uh, scientists uh, from uh, different disciplines, different countries, different continents and different cultures. The interaction between the scientists seems to be highly stimulating. And then uh, it exposes these scientists to probably new and also known technologies. And it's an excellent opportunity uh, to generate uh, interaction and to learn and to learn uh, from each other. The summer program is a very good opportunity for, for young students to learn more about sustainable agriculture. It's exciting to be lecturing here with, with young people who come from different backgrounds and in different countries. And I'm really excited to, to share my knowledge but, but also my ideas uh, with these you know, young students. So I want to, to really challenge them, them to, to think about how can we improve things, how can we improve farming uh, to make this a better world. The topics covers many areas, for example, biodiversity, uh, smart farming, uh, precision agriculture, uh, soils, climate change, and also waste treatments all come together to bring the knowledge to our young students to be a leader in agriculture in the future. We are tasked to do the project on the phytoremediation. So we are asking information on how they are treating the wastewater because uh, we would like to improve the phytoremediation project of the UGM. So phytoremediation basically uses uh, crops, uh, for example, asola, stargrass, um, even uh, the graminate species to help filter or clean the wastewater that um, is being discharged in this uh, wastewater system facility. Uh, my teamwork, uh, we have been here for four times and actually we found a lot of problems such as the using of electricity, uh, the problem of uh, the long period of time of this process, also the problem of the high number of the employee in this company, also the problem of the, the mix of this crop issue with the plastic. So we worked together and we found some solution to solve this problem and we also make some recommendations to how to improve this uh, process or this unit in the future to using smart uh, machines in the future. I'm doing an activity about hydroponic and aquaponic. 
uh, here in Gajamada, I'm learning in hydroponic because it's more cheaper and also we use many filters uh, and hydroponic uh, is a system uh, we use, uh, we, can we can grow a plant without soil. Me and my friend, we are trying to make a new design for, uh, for BSF. What is BSF? Well, it's a black solder flies. So the houses are going to, to solve some issues, which is uh, making a new fertilizer, second, finding an alternative food for the animals, and the third is saving money and time for all the aspects, and also make it more interesting for the farmers. And uh, during the summer course program, we're working on a project uh, about the integrative farming uh, system in a small scale to improve and uh, maximize the yield and uh, improve the socioeconomy. It was really a great experience and we got new knowledge and information. I am hopeful that the knowledge gained from this program will be useful for my future studies and the career. 
and actually I learned a lot from this program um, more even though I come from different background which is chemical engineering it is I gain many new knowledge about agriculture and I do think that maybe in the future I can relate the agriculture and my back, uh, my study which is about the chemical engineering it was really informative and creative and the there's many new ideas, I've got new ideas, I've got contact with many experienced people and I hope in the next year everything will be better than this in order to improve these things because this is the first one and absolutely the first one was really fabulous. And for the next year, we will have again the second summer course with uh, more interesting topics and hopefully more experts will come and also more students from overseas can join our summer course. Thank you, Piat and UGM. Piat UGM, the best.